home side here, ninth in League Two. Playoff final losers last season. League Cup exploits to remember from last season as well. Seth Bennett looks inside. Can't stop Redmond cutting onto his right foot and he hits the crossbar. Comes back down. No offside flag yet. And Saints do have the lead. And on his debut, Armando Brogia has scored for Southampton. A thunderous shot from Nathan Redmond, crashed off the crossbar from 20-odd yards out. You always think with players like that, if they, that goal goes in, like, say, Adams in his first eight matches. Now, bad pass by Hall. Saints are in here in the box on the right, and Redmond has totally wasted that. Oh, it's been... They've, they've robbed... They've put pressure on the defence. Louis Hall has played it inside to Redmond. He's in the box, about 12, 13 yards out. Battery up against Hall. Goes inside, then outside. Could get to the byline, looks to check, and he leaves the ball behind him. Needs some support here, Jan Valerie. He's got himself two defenders on him. Somehow he's still going. Pulls it back towards the edge of the penalty area. Ward Prowse will collect it. Central is Diallo. Now Teller, 20 yards out, will shoot low. It deflects and goes wide. Will it be a corner? Yes, says Darren Drysdale. Corner to Saints. Saints for me looking very, very bright, very sharp tonight. Yeah. Volleyed away by Jan Valery up towards halfway. Brozier doesn't get there ahead of Hall. But Saints will break. First time ball from Elianusi. There's onside, he's Teller. Teller's onside. Low shot, 2 0. And Saints double the lead. And the Newport fans complain at the same assistant who gave Brozier's goal. But Teller was onside. Brozier might not have been, but Nathan Teller's second goal for Saints. Boos around Rodney Parade, apart from the fans in red and white, away to that far side, celebrating with Nathan Teller. Newport nil, Southampton two. Terrific counter-attack by Southampton. Ball's played out, it's gone down the left-hand side. Teller latches onto it, goes through on his own, draws the goalkeeper, calm as you, as you, as you like, and just slips it past him, 2-0. Now, here comes Walker Peters off that left wing. He's enjoying playing as a left fullback, Dave. He's been flying. Redmond dinks one up, stands one up into the penalty area, just drifts over everyone's heads in the middle. Kept by for Saints by Valerie. Then a great ball from Stevens to Ward Prowse. He hangs one up to the back post from the right. The low shot comes in, it goes wide from Walker Peters. Saints won a corner, it's a goal kick. What's that happen to doing extremely well tonight? As soon as the man gets the ball, they've got people around him, they're overloading. Uh, Newport and they just can't get near them Lewis picks it up his long blonde hair plays it back to Bennett but a poor pass looking for Dolan who's trying to get into the attack so they're short-handed at the back and the Saints are breaking here comes Diallo through the middle he's got Redmond to his left finds Redmond Brozier's to his right Redmond onto his right foot and it's wide tried to curl it inside the far post couldn't get it right and that could have been and perhaps should have been a goal for Nathan Redmond for the second time this evening. Yes, he's, he's done well there, mind Adam. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back to Rodney Parade. We lost the line and Carl Walker-Peters scored, unfortunately, while we lost the line. Low shot. Driven right-footed, beat the keeper at his near post. And now the ball with Bennett. Tackled, though. Saints get it back. Ward-Prowse made the challenge. It falls nicely for Brozier in the box. Narrow angle, right-footed shot. Slammed and then pushed in. And Saints are 4-0 up straight after half-time. And it may well be Moy Elianusi, who's managed to get on the end of the shot from Brozier, which was blocked by Townsend. And Elianusi has a Southampton goal. Well, back from Celtic and back well, at the club, in the team, and now has a goal for Saints. To James Ward-Prowse in the centre circle. A little low ball forward, he's clever, he's through to Elianusi. Right-footed, well, he didn't score for Saints in his first spell at the club, and now he's got two in one night. Two and a half, and Saints fifth of the evening. Newport nil, Southampton five, Moy Elianusi second of the night, low crisp finish past Townsend, this one's done. So that'll do nicely. And Saints in control. There's actually 
speaking to somebody just today who knew somebody else. Now, Saints rob them of the possession again. Bennett dispossessed. Diallo skipped past a couple of challenges into Elianusi. Short pass, another shot, another goal. Brozier's second on debut for Southampton. And they are firing too many guns, too many bullets for Newport County. Chris finish, looked up, 6-0. We haven't even got to the hour mark yet. Brilliant, and once again, it's the closing down and the pressure of the governor, pressuring the ball very, very quickly. Ball played into Redmond, low shot, right-footed, oh, and finally that is a has goal. his goal. Just controlled it, and on the half volley from inside the D, hit it low, right-footed, second touch, first touch control, hit it as it landed on the bounce, and then smashed it low past Townsend. Nottinghamshire need 43 runs to win from eight overs with seven wickets in hand, so they're cruising like Saints against Hampshire, unfortunately, at Trembridge. The T20 commentary continuing with that, of course, on digital. And the free view as Forster comes. Oh, Forster's clattered by Greenwich, doesn't get back in time. The shot goes wide. Has the referee actually blown a whistle as Ellison hit it wide? Forster six foot seven. Big, big Jordan Greenwich took him out. That was like a big daddy splash was going on there. That was Battle of the Giants day. Well, Those was two, two Goliaths there. Yeah, so absolutely. Hitting each other. Never mind, David. You're right. We had two Goliaths. Two for Elianusi. His first goals for the club. A second for Brozier. And then Nathan Redmond's first of the season in the 69th minute. Make it seven. And we're in stoppage time. And Elianusi wants a hat trick. And he's got his hat trick. Two seasons away at Celtic, comes back to Southampton, wants to prove himself, and on his first appearance of the season, scores three goals in an 8 0 win for Saints in the second round of the League Cup. He's made himself a difficult to mark. He's got in among the goals, and to get that third one and score a hat trick, I think the boy's done very, very well. I agree with you, Dave. Reaction to come later on before 10, maybe. A very good night for Saints. Terrific professional performance in what looked like an awkward tie on paper for Southampton. They've come to Rodney Parade. They've arrived with the right attitude, the right strategy, and absolutely the right levels of skill and finishing tonight because it's been a great night for Saints.